Nice group bring these bulls. Uh, I'm going to try to buy some of these bulls tomorrow. There's six of these in this pen. Stout, good ranching bulls. You know, they have enough character, but not too much. Take away from your calf, uh, too much ear in your calves. Cow would go on Brayford, you're going back on Brangus, these crossbred cows. Um, but nice bulls, great disposition. We weigh 16, probably. 17, yeah, 16. 15. Yeah, 16, 17. Ah, that one weigh 50. Let's, let's say 15 to 17. Catch it pretty good. Good bulls, though. I'm trying to put these videos together. I'll take several different segments of video and do my best to put them together. But this is a nice group of bulls. Kind of show what kind of bulls. I'm planning on buying some of these bulls tomorrow. Hey, bull. Hey, bull. And obviously, didn't resell them to my client base. That's what I do. Hey, bull. Nice thick hip bull there. Yeah, scared him. Nice big ass bull. Anyway, here's one penny of these bulls. Bull in 117. This bull looks like he's a first generation bull. Typically, first generation bulls carry more, more char character than say multi generation brangus bulls. So it looks like a first generation bull. Gonna have oh, a little more leather. Got a nice enough gentle bull. Again, he the, he's a little more leather than your typical brangus bull. But lots of first generation bulls like that. Yeah. Dawson's bull number 17. Bull number 17. But if a guy has, if someone has a hurt, doesn't have much ear in them, but these kind of bulls make them black hide and put a, you know, put a little more character, more look in them. I obviously, be, I'll read some nice looking females out of them too. Bull number 17, bull number 17. Again, these bulls sell tomorrow. I, typically, I, I will buy some bulls and bring them back home to resell them. Bull number 17. Bull number 14. I like this bull. He's got a cool looking, a little more left, but big bone. This is that New Mexico pin that bulls again, New Mexico 273. Little more character. He's got big, pretty good thing again. I'm comparing these against their peer group, not against Maines and Angus and Charlie's, who I typically sell. But for Brian, this bull's got a nice ass in him, big enough bone, kind of good character. So if the cow had, needs some ass, some leather, and some navel, he'll do that too. Bull number 17, uh, 14, 14. Uh, restoration number is 1104. The bull's number 12, uh, 12. No, no, 11, 11. I like this bull. I do need to trim his back feet. Uh, they're a little long, but, you know, he's a nice bull, and he seems to be walking just fine. Just I'm aware that whoever buys him, I'm going to trim his feet. Bull, I'm sorry, his number's 10. Bull number 10. I like his bull. Huge butt, not a bunch of character. Your cattle need to have a little navel in them because this bull pins a little cleaner, pinned bull like the bull 13. You really got to look to find his little navel. Not a lot of sheep in these bulls. But anyway, nice good bulls. Bulls, he's pulled a little more grow in these bulls here. A little bigger bulls. The three and the four bull are, are out of a lead gun. Obviously, he's a Mountain Creek bull. Oh, this shadow's kind of get me, but nice enough bulls though. Bigger bulls, a little more frame, these bulls. They're fat and fully grown. They'll be big boys. It's bull number four. And three, they're both lead guns. Yeah. So, a little bigger, kind of these boys. Again, these bulls are full grown, be big bull, big boys. I don't think it's probably two, two and a half now. A couple of nice red rings over there. I don't see those very much, red rings. Anyway, get through these bulls as fast as I can. The stout bulls are big, powerful, growthy kind of high-performing kind of rangus bulls, and great, really good disposition on these bulls. There's three again. Again, three and three and four. That bulls are outstanding bull, and I don't know what the other bulls are. Bull number five. Hey bull, hey bull. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, this bull here is number twenty. Yeah, yeah. These bulls are very gentle. And bull over there is 19, I believe. Super gentle bulls. Again, these bulls look like these bulls can have some growing to them too. I've, you know, a lot of performance in these two bulls here.
be bigger, bigger bulls than this one here for sure. He'll be a bigger kind of more of a high performer, high yielding kind of bull. He a stout bull and he goes, oh, both of them bulls. You know, this bull here, huh, a little better bull than the other one. Anyway, nice to bring his bulls. Yeah, yeah. Again, normally I buy these bulls for clients and I buy them and sell like this and resell them. So I can get the heads up. Again, the shadow's not that good in this barn, but do the best I can. Three nice stout Brangus bulls. Uh, big body, really good bull in the middle there. Number eight, bull number eight. He's a he's kind of a beast. Bull number six. I just don't know what I don't know what they are, but I can I obviously can evaluate bulls pretty good and tell you what they should, you know. That's the best bull in his group. Eight's the best bull. The other two bulls aren't bad bulls, but they aren't the bull that Adam Braid is. Anyway, Spring's bull sell tomorrow. And typically, I buy them, take them back home, resell them. So if clients are looking at them, well, my plans are to buy some bulls for y'all guys. All these bulls offering tomorrow are really good dispositions. You're not a crazy one of the deal. These bulls got some guts now. Whew. Belly draggers. Oh, Y3 there. He's going to be a beast when he grows up, though. Anyway, again, I'm in the shadow. Got to, got to do some little trust in place. This is all Clay does, so I can think I know what a good bull looks like. Nice group of stout Hereford bulls. Bulls are coming to the girls looks like. They're good. Good bulls. <laughs> Yeah, I get credit where credit's due. Here we raise these good boys. It's a good job. Little meat wagons. Good herf, so. Chunky dude right there. Again, I give credit where credit's due. Somebody's got a good herf for all damn sure. Be a player on them on a good one. Anyway, here's a nice herf for bulls. Sell tomorrow.